Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim ibn al-Qayyim rahimahullah after speaking about dua goes on to mention an extremely important point. He says that the servant of Allah should be aware of sins that affect him and he should not fall into the trap of those who do as they please with the excuse that Allah is most merciful, he will forgive, etc. Yes, Allah is the most forgiving, the most merciful. And this group of people claim to have good thoughts of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He goes on to mention that truly speaking, having good thoughts of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala go hand in hand with doing that which is good and making an effort to stay away from that which is evil. He then goes on to mention countless ahadith where... Yes, we know Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is merciful and he is the most forgiving. He loves to forgive, but at the same time, he is just and he has wisdom. And he mentions many a hadith where a person may do what seems to be insignificant, yet they would be punished severely. And one of the hadith he mentions where the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, إِيَّاكُمْ وَمُحَقَّرَاتِ الذُّنُوبِ Which means be careful especially of the sins or be careful of the sins that seem to be insignificant. Then the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wasallam goes to give an example of a group of people who gather stick by stick. So they've gone and they get some wood. One stick, this one brings, another one brings another stick. And eventually they've got so many sticks and if they had to light it, it's an extremely big fire. So in the same way, the sins one small sin and another small sin and they all add up and they destroy the servant. So it's extremely important for us to actually make an effort to do good and to make an effort to stay away from that which is evil. And at the end of the day, uh, we believe that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is most merciful. He will forgive, but we should also make the effort.